hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new around here hi my name is madeline and i'm so happy that you were here today thank you so much for clicking on my video i hope you enjoy it is friday for me it is about 10 45 and i am about to leave to go tan and i can't decide um if you've seen my previous vlogmas videos you know that i went to plato's closet and tried to sell some stuff and they took like seven things and i took like 50 things in there so I'm debating to go to a different Plato's location because I live in Indy and there's like four or five maybe and seeing if they will take stuff. But like, I don't want to suffer through the embarrassment of them being like, we're taking none of this, you know? I don't know what to do. I'll probably just end up taking everything to Goodwill a different day. Oh, and then we're going to go tan and I need to swing by probably like a Target or something. I need a binder for a final project that I need to work on this weekend. And then we are just gonna be editing videos, working on school and cleaning because Ian is coming up today and we are actually going to our very first escape room tonight. So I'm really excited about that. And then we are also gonna go see, um, I live in downtown Indy if you're new. So we are gonna go see the monument tonight cause they made it like a Christmas tree for Christmas. And I wanna go take pictures with it and stuff. So just indie blogger things. Got this cute little Santa mug from Target. I saw these on TikTok. There was a gingerbread man one too, but he was not at the Target I went to. And I got that on Black Friday. Speaking of Black Friday, my Black Friday vlog actually just went live a little bit ago, about 45 minutes ago. My videos go live at 10 a.m. every day. Turn on my notifications so you don't miss it. We're sitting right at 525 subscribers. My goal is 550 for December, so. If you like this video make sure that you subscribe to help me hit that goal and so that you don't miss more videos from me and if you like this video why wouldn't you subscribe i just wanted to introduce the vlog say hello i hope you enjoy and let's go ahead and run some errands okay so the lighting is really weird and i'm sorry but i just made it to suntan city um i did decide to go ahead and try for the second plato's closet so my clothes are in there right now so I decided to go to Suntan City while they were doing that. So I'm going to go ahead and head on into Suntan. And I will keep you guys updated on how Play-Dohs goes. All right, y'all. So I just got out of Play-Dohs. And they actually did end up taking some stuff, which I was glad about because I was seriously so nervous for no reason. Um, I'm going to go ahead and head on over to Target, pick up the things I need, and head home to clean because Ian is leaving <laughs> in probably about an hour to drive up here. And so I have some cleaning to do and I would like to work on school a little bit because I know I won't do much school this weekend. It is 12.15 right now and I'm surrounded by so many restaurants and I wanna order food so bad, but I'm gonna be good and eat the food that's in my house. I'm gonna drink my coffee now. I also passed so many Starbucks and Dunkin's and stuff and like I don't really like Dunkin' but I'll drink it. Took a lot of self-control to not pull into one of those drive throughs All right, you guys, I just made it to Target. This is actually a super Target and I forgot about that. So we're gonna head on in, get all the things we need. All right, you guys, I am back in the car and I got some extra things. I got some candy and wrapping paper and some hot chocolate. So I know I said I was gonna eat food at home, but Chick-fil-A is sounding mighty delicious. So I'm gonna get Chick-fil-A. <laughs> I seriously, when I live here, I'm really good about not eating out. Like, I usually eat my food at home. So, I'm not too worried about going to Chick fil A literally once. So, I'm going to head on over there, get some yummy lunch, and then we are finally heading home. All right, you guys, I'm here in the Chick fil A drive thru, and it is literally wrapped around the building. Like, this line is freaking huge. But. I will say Chick-fil-A has the most efficient drive through I think I've ever been in in my entire life. So this actually probably won't even take long at all. What I usually get at Chick-fil-A is grilled nuggets and fries and a large water. They have a really good frosted coffee if you guys are coffee lovers. So yummy. So I don't think I'm going to get a frosted coffee today though because I already have a coffee with me. All right, you guys. So just got my food. and I'm going to sit here and eat my grilled nuggets really quick because there's no good way to eat them while driving because you need a fork and you're like dipping them in sauce and stuff and it's just really hard to eat while driving so i'm gonna eat my nuggets really quick so good after that i'm gonna go ahead and head on home and i will talk to you guys when i get there all right hi friends we are home i actually just dropped some presents i love this paper i got at target you guys look how cute 
I just love that. I think it's so pretty. It was literally in the dollar section for a dollar. I'm gonna put them under the tree. Hee <laughs> hee. My mom and my brother Mason's presents. And we are gonna get to cleaning this kitchen and living room because they are gross. And I just bought a Swiffer duster, so we're gonna dust today, which it's really disgusting to think about how I've lived here since August and we've never dusted. I've used like paper towels and stuff, so like I promise it's not disgusting in here, but a Swiffer duster just picks it up so much better, so. So I'm gonna clean the kitchen, my room and my bathroom in the living room but they're like attached so when I say the kitchen I mean like this whole space and yeah let's go ahead and get to cleaning All right, you guys, my poor tripod is like about to freaking fall apart. So I think I'm going to order a new one on Amazon, but I am going to do my Bible reading for today. I'm doing the 24 days of Luke challenge where you read a chapter of Luke every day from the 1st to the 24th because there's 24 chapters in Luke. And by the time you are done, you will have read Jesus' story and are ready to celebrate the meaning of Christmas. So. I am gonna read my chapter for today. After that, I think I'm going to do a little bit of schoolwork and um, here in a little over an hour, I'm gonna start on dinner. So I'm gonna go ahead and get on with my reading and I will talk to you guys later. All right, you guys. So I just finished my reading and we are gonna get started on some dinner. So we are making lasagna tonight. So I'm gonna get everything out for that. This is literally the easiest lasagna recipe that exists. All you need is pasta sauce, noodles, cottage cheese, ground beef. I've made it with ground chicken as well if you don't like beef. Um, it tastes a little bit different. I prefer beef in mine. Mozzarella cheese and an egg. So we are going to start by browning our ground beef and then we are also going to cook these noodles because I don't think they are oven ready we're gonna get some water to boil our noodles we're gonna preheat the oven to 375 chop up some onion and add that to the ground beef all right so we have the onion cooking and while that is cooking we are gonna take a bowl and add cottage cheese to it use the rest of that up so you are gonna take that cottage cheese and one egg and you're gonna put that in there oh and drop the shell in with it you know that's an essential step and then you are gonna mix that together nice and yummy all right so we are about to add our sauce to the ground beef and onion and Normally I pick like the garlic one or garden veggie, but since this one is just Parmesan, I'm gonna add some Italian seasoning and garlic salt to it as well. So we're gonna go ahead and put that in with the ground beef and just let that simmer together. Okay, so my noodles finished cooking and I went ahead and added the first layer because you have to move kind of fast with these um, because they get sticky and stuff. So you start with a layer of noodles, add a layer of this mixture, add a layer of the sauce and beef and all that stuff, and then you add a layer of mozzarella cheese and you repeat that twice. So we're gonna go ahead and do that one. All right, y'all, here she is in all of her beauty. So this is just gonna go in the oven at 375 for 45 minutes and then it cools for 15 and it is ready to serve. So I will see you guys in about 45 minutes. And here she is all cooked she's been cooling for a little bit so we're gonna go ahead and eat some dinner Ian is here now and we are setting up the oculus in um, the living room we cleared it out big open space to play we just ate dinner it was really yummy what you think Ian it's pretty good yeah. and 
We're gonna play this for a little bit and then I will start getting ready because we have an escape room at nine. We've just been chilling, eating dinner, and now we are. Okay. Ian is getting this all set up. I am gonna go ahead and get ready. You can see like the prints from my Oculus thing being on my head, but um, Ian is out there playing out right now. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup. I'm not gonna do much to my hair. I'm just gonna take it out of the braids and let it be like waves. And I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do to my makeup yet. I think I'm just gonna do something pretty simple because we're just going to an escape room and it's already like seven. So it won't even be on that long. So I don't really care too much about what it looks like. So I'm gonna go ahead and do my makeup and I think I'm gonna set a time lapse so that you guys can watch me get ready. All right, y'all, so we are about to leave. This is what I'm wearing. I have a Carhartt beanie on. My puffer is from Old Navy. And then I have a pink sweater from Target on. And then these are Levi's and the Sperry duck boots. So we are gonna go to the escape room right now. And it's about 15 minutes away, so we're gonna leave here soon because we're supposed to get there early. After that, we are gonna go see the monument all lit up for Christmas, so I'm very excited for that. And yeah, we're gonna go ahead and head on out. <laughs> Our living room furniture is currently in the kitchen because we moved it around to play the Oculus, but. Are you excited? He's excited, don't let him fool you guys. When we get there, I'm gonna leave this camera in the car. We can't record in the escape room anyways, so. I'm gonna bring you guys along and leave you in the car, and then I will tell you guys about it when we are done. Okay, so I'm now vlogging on my phone. We found parking. The parking lot you normally park at for the escape room was full, so I got really stressed, but we're parked at the mall, and it should only be $3, so it's way better because the parking lot for the escape room is like 20 bucks. So we are gonna go ahead and walk on over. Hi friends, we just made it back to the car. We got, um, I got a iced vanilla latte and Ian got a hot chocolate. Was it just a regular hot yep. chocolate? Um, from, what's that place called? The Chocolate Shop? Chocolate Cafe. Chocolate Cafe on um, like where the monument is in downtown Indy. Super yummy. Um, the escape room was lots of fun. <laughs> We about broke up. <laughs> uh, we almost broke up in the escape room because you. I was getting very stressed and I was yelling at him, but we made it. We made it out. I was just trying to have a good time. <laughs> we made it out and we beat the record for that room. How many? We had like twenty six seconds left. You also beat up my heart. I was not that bad.
I was not that bad. I want the recording of the freaking video. Because he was doing dumb things in there, and I was trying yeah. to get out of prison. He doesn't like the the like jail breakout one. Um, we'll have to go back again and do another one. A harder one. I think we're ready. So the escape room was a lot of fun. Ten out of ten recommend. We went and looked at the monument, took some pictures, and they started like a little show thing. But we left. So we're gonna go ahead and head on back to my apartment. All right, y'all. So I never finished this vlog out. So if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please give it a thumbs up so that I know. Leave a comment down below and subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow.